Okay, alright, alright, listen. Okay, by the the title, I'm pretty sure y'all could, you know, y'all could see what I'm talking about here. Um, the story I'm finna tell y'all I has never been said. They wouldn't want they wouldn't talk about it, but you know, it is what it is. I'm gonna talk about it. Cool, too. Cause now I look back on it, I think it's pretty funny. Story time about when I fucked a deaf girl. Now, in my advantage, I didn't know she was deaf. Okay? Because I met her on Facebook. They always just they say be careful who you meet online. But this girl was looking mighty fine. So I saw this thick girl on Facebook, right? Thicker than a bowl of oatmeal. Thicker than a bowl of grits with extra butter and cheese in it. I promise you. One of the most thick girls I have ever seen in my life. She was hella fine. And I had got her number with ease. Like, looks like these. Ease, man. So I hit her up and I said, like, yo, where you from? Blah, blah, blah. She told me she was from. And I said, where you live at? Turns out this girl lived down the street from me. I'm like, I have never seen this girl a day in my life. I think I was like... 15, 15, 16 years old. A lot of crazy shit happened to me at 15 to 16 years old. So, a few days later, I got her to come through and chill with me. And, yeah, yeah I got her to chill with me for a few days. So, when I told her to um, come to my house, I told her to call me when you get out, like when you get to my driveway or whatever. She said she couldn't hear for some sort. She said, I couldn't hear. Like, she texted me and said she couldn't hear. I'm like, mm, alright, whatever. Because on my mind at the time, I ain't thinking nothing stupid. I'm like, yo. Maybe it's on her phone. I don't know. So I really didn't pay that, I didn't pay that too much of attention. I didn't, like, she knocked on the door and I opened it. And it wasn't like a R knock. It was more like a you know, to knock. I, mean, I was just in the living room. I, I was like, all right, go ahead and come on in. So when she walked inside the house, I was like, I thought I told you to call me. She just looked at me. Like, she just looked at me. When I said, I thought I told you to call me, she, like, she was like this. So I told her, let's go to my room. Like I was like, just follow me. Anyway, <laughs> here go the strange part. I was like, yo, what do you want to watch? She was just staring at me. Now, I know I'm good looking as hell, but like she was like just staring at me like this. Like, what the fuck wrong with you, dog? And then she just was staring at me. I'm Like I said, still not paying no attention. Wasn't paying no signs to it or not. I kinda, I'm kind of hard, cold hearted. So I was like, yo, stop being... You know, stop being so damn weird. Just say something. Like, talk to me. Like, the way I look back and now I think I was yelling at her. But I'm not sure if I was yelling at her. Because if I was yelling at her, she couldn't hear me anyway. So I didn't really care. So, I had, um, as I was talking, mid conversation, I had yawn. I was like, <sighs> so, yeah. So she started, like, throwing up gang signs. So I thought she was on a gang sign. She was like, Me being the real dude that I am, I was like, hold on, you ain't finna be repping your set inside my house. I don't game bang, so I was like, you know what? Let me. I started throwing mine back, and I, I was doing all that. I think I'm lying. I, if you know me, you know that I did it. I'm, I'm not lying. She, like smacked her hand three times like this, like Uncle Willie from, um, you know, Friday when he was like, um, you been pussy whipped. He was, she was like, like. I thought I started throwing my hands back like a black girl getting mad. I was like, I was on rhythm and everything. Throwing up my set too, you know. Brah, clack, 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 clack. And I don't game bang, but like I said, she want to get that way. I can get that way too. So like I said, just here's here's why I felt kind of bad. So she texts me and she said, "UK," which is like you know, she like you know I'm deaf. I took a good pause, I said, so I, I got my phone, I had my phone, I was like, hey, I kind of felt bad, my heart dropped, I immediately thought that she must have thought that I knew that, right, so, and I thought that she thought that I was yelling at her, when I really wasn't yelling at her, because I thought she was yelling at me, I mean, because she started like, you know, I, I was confused, I didn't know what to do. As I was up, I walked to the bathroom, and I um, I I was going, I walked to the bathroom, and I like I was laughing my ass off, like I was crying laughing, but I was like, damn, Vishen, you so mean, you so mean, bro, you messed up for that, you know. I didn't close the bathroom door, nope, wanna know why? Cause she couldn't hear me, so why would I do that? I go in the room, go sit down on the bed, whatever, next to her, I rub a leg in it, I rub a leg and everything. I was like, it's cool. I'm mouthing it. I'm not saying I'm like. And like she look at me, she like, she give me a look, that look like that. Right? I was like, I'm finna knock the death out this pussy. I'm finna knock the death. By the time I'm done hitting it, she gonna learn how to talk. I strapped up. I went to town on her butt. I like I was 
I was, I was in it. I was in it like, like Thanksgiving turkey. I was in that as I'm hitting it, right? You know, she's making some sound. I'm like, it's kind of throwing me off my game. I'm like, I am stroking. She's like, <laughs> like young thug. You know how young thug rap is something like that. You know, she was making some type of sounds like that, and I was like. This is kind of weird. I know how Young Thug mumble rap. That's kind of like how she was saying. She come texting me, and she said, "We shouldn't talk anymore because of lack of communication." I was like, "What?" I was like, "Cause of lack of communication." I was like, "I just got broken up by a deaf girl." Well, we weren't dating, but still, I was like, "This is crazy." Anyway, man, if you like that video, I say in the story time. Subscribe, hit the like button. Uh. Subscribe, hit the like button. Um, yeah, moral to the story is, uh, I guess be careful who you talk to on social media because I have a lot of social media crazy stories I could tell y'all. They just private, and that's one of them.